Good morning, Bill Ball here over on Albee Road, bright and early on a Wednesday morning. We are demolishing this tile roof and we're converting it to a shingle roof. The homeowner here is allowed to do that. It's not in an HOA, so he wanted to go with a much less costly expense than, uh, than tile. So shingle is about half the price of a tile roof. It'll be good for about 15 years and uh, give him a really nice look here on this house. So let me show you a little bit about how we do the process. The first step is to get all of the tile and the old underlayment off the roof. You can see here the men are carefully removing all of the old tile. They're inspecting the deck as they do it. They're going to renail the entire deck. There's a lot of tile that has to come off. This is probably the most invasive part of the process. We're very safe. We make sure that we put down plywood everywhere. We protect the entire home in the process of removal inspect everything get it down to the bare wood make sure that there's no rotted lumber on the roof we have a crew leader on site at all times lewis is our crew leader on this project great man does a great job make sure that everything's being done top notch Now you can see there's a lot of nails that are in the roof. They all come out and we renail the entire deck. The valleys are very important. That's where most failures are going to happen in any roof. So we take extra special care in uh, getting the valleys cleaned out, double lining the valleys with new shingle, new underlayment. We use a poly stick, peel and stick underlayment. It's virtually bulletproof is what I like to say. It's important to keep the surface free of all debris when the men are up there working. This is for safety reasons. They'll use the blower to blow off any kind of granular so that the deck's not slippery. Uh, you can slip very easily on that surface. Lots of material has to come off this roof. We take extra special care to protect things like pool cages, any kind of screening or gutters that might be on the house. You don't have to remove your gutters. And if you have good gutters on the house already, when we're putting on your new shingle roof, we make sure that we take extra special care in all the other things that are around the house, including the landscaping, so that it's uh, pristine when we're finished. Rápido. Like that? Okay, that's enough for me. Easy money. All right, so this is one of our crew members here, Naon. He's a good man. I see him on every job. You got to stay, uh, stay well hydrated, right? You got to drink a lot of agua. A lot of agua. I'll bring you some peppers. You like peppers, Naon? And here we are on a Tuesday morning after Labor Day weekend. The job was 100% completed on Saturday. The guys did a great job. So I'm gonna get up there and I'm gonna just show you what we did here. You saw the progress photos, you saw the progress videos. Now you can see the completed project. It's a beautiful roof color. It's a glacier white. It's a very energy efficient roof. This is one of the highest energy efficiency ratings for a roof. You can see that we have all the ridge vents installed. Went around all the plumbing boot caps, painted them to color to match the roof. Real nice project. This was a tile roof converted to a shingle roof. And it's okay to do. You can take, you know, a tile roof and you can convert it to shingle 
but you can't go from shingle to tile without any special engineering involved. It takes a lot of engineering work. You got to make sure the roof can support that kind of weight, but it is 100% okay to go from a tile roof to a shingle. It's about half the cost. Guys did a beautiful job. A plus. And that's why we have a five-star Google review with over 170 positive reviews on Google. Not one complaint.